Hello viewers, I'm Stephen Hode, aka The Stop Hunter and welcome to MT5 Tips and Tricks. So just before we get started, just a quick one for you. Just to let you know, everything I'm going to do in this MT5 series is based on the Blueberry Markets MT5 platform. They're one I use to trade myself, so that's why I'm using it. If you want to do exactly the same as me, there's a link below in the description for you to follow. If you want to you know, get into them as a broker, like I said, um, good broker, been using them for a while. At the end of this video, I'll put a, a link to a video review I did on so you can find out more if you want. So with that, let's get in today's content. So you've downloaded the MT5 software, you know, you've got the platform open. You know that the broker you're using covers many, many markets, but you just can't seem to find the symbols as they call them on NT5 or MT4 to actually trade the ones you want to look at. It really is quite straightforward, very simple, and we're going to look at that right now. So we're in the desktop MT5 Blueberry Markets uh, trading platform, and I've played around with it already, so you might not see this exact setup, and we're going to have a look at how to set up your page in a later video. Also draw your attention down the left there to this thing called Market Watch. I call that the watch list of stocks. Now you can build that up, um, take away, you know, create how you like, and we'll look at that also in another video. But for this purpose, you know, you might be lucky and get a watch list set up for you already, but it might be missing the stock or the um, commodity, the FX pair that you might be interested in trading. So how do we find them very quickly? Well, if we go up to the top, there's this yellow little sim, uh, dollar symbol here. If we click on that, it's going to bring up this box called symbols and everything with inside your broker um, that operates on the MT5 platform, you know, in terms of markets available to trade will be in this box. Now, it depends on what broker you're using. Blueberry Market's very good for covering off quite a lot of different markets. Some might just have Forex in. Some might have Forex indices that can have a blend. You know, it depends on the broker. Fortunate MT5 on Blueberry covers quite a lot of markets, you know, even cryptocurrencies, um, stocks. You know, let's just find a typical stock that we might want. Um, let's have a look down. You scroll through. There's so many to pick from here. That's Alibaba. Let's click on that, the Chinese stock. You want to find out about it, just highlight it. And it will give you all the specification behind the scenes of, you know, the, like it says, digits, contract size, spread levels, margins, all that information, important information, trading hours um, for you to watch. Now, that is... Um, really it for finding symbols like i said in other videos we're going to look what to do next how we can add that to a watch list or how we can use that to trade straight away from or you know place an order around but for the moment that's how we navigate through to finding the markets that we like and like i said you've got an awful lot to choose from i'm on blueberry here all different currencies loads of different indices even cryptos commodities all covered as well so a good selection for you trade like i said a lot of international stocks as well which is also what mt5 offers over mt4 you couldn't have this amount of instruments to trade um, on the mt4 platform you just can't host them and that's the beauty of it so there you go that's finding the symbols the markets to trade very very quickly within the platform so don't forget to hit the subs button and bell notification button to receive updates when I'm going to produce other video content around MT5 and for that matter anything else on the YouTube channel. So get pressing right now and as promised that link to the Blueberry Markets Broker Review coming up now.